Y'all back with the Cornelius Catfish channel. And today, y'all, we decided to try something new. We decided to try rabbit hot wing. Now, this was Cornelius' idea. And he's not here right now, but he wanted me to go ahead and do the video because I'm the one that usually fries the fish, the chicken, and do hot wings on a regular. So this is my first time actually doing rabbit hot wings, but I'm going to use the same technique that I use to do the chicken hot wings. Now, I have the rabbit legs in the sink. I already washed them off. And I have right here some Sweet Baby Ray's Buffalo Wing Sauce. Now, you can use whatever sauce you want. You can use barbecue sauce. I sometimes use uh, Buffalo Wild Wing Sauce because you know they have all those different kinds. And it really don't matter whatever sauce you want to use. I have the grease getting hot over here. It's heating up because I'm going to have to fry these legs in a minute. So let's get started. We're going to start out by seasoning these uh rabbit legs now i already washed them off and everything so it's already clean i had it sitting in salt water and everything so i'm just gonna go ahead and season these legs up now i'm not gonna go too hard on the seasoning here because i feel like this sauce sometimes be salty itself so i'm just gonna start out with this creole right here i also have um onion powder I'm going light, you all. I'm not using a lot. I have garlic powder. And I have pepper I'm going to just put on the top of this. Now, I'm going to flip these over. And I'm going to do the other side the same way. Like I said, I'm not going too hard and too heavy on the seasoning. I'm just trying to, you know, season it up so you can taste the seasoning a little bit. Now. I'm going to go ahead and do this side. Once again, this is the Creole. This video shouldn't be long, by the way. It's just really simple. This is a simple technique. This is usually how I do the chicken. This is my first time doing rabbit, but I'm going to do it the same exact way. I'm putting the garlic powder back on this side. Season this side with a little more onion. And I'm going to add um, a little pepper to it. So this is how I do the chicken. I usually season it up like season it up like this, and um, I'm waiting for the oil to get hot. So when this oil get hot, I'm gonna be right back with you all, and I'm gonna show you all how I fry it up and everything. So stick with us, stay tuned, and once again, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. Okay, right we're back, back y'all. Now we just seasoned up the rabbit legs with Creole garlic powder and onion powder and pepper. Now. I've seen some people make hot wings and some people put flour on their chicken before they fry it and put it in the grease. But here, I'm not going to do that. I don't do that with the chicken hot wings either. So right now, I'm just about to take these seasoned rabbit legs right here and I'm just going to put them in the grease as they are. So let me see how many can fit in here. They all probably can fit in here. Yeah, I'm just going to stick all these in here. And uh, the grease is already hot. So we're going to let this cook. And uh, I'll show y'all how the texture and stuff, how it comes out uh, when it's done frying. So just give me a minute. Let these uh, rabbit legs fry up. We say it a thousand times. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. And we will be right, right back. Okay, now we're done frying the rabbit legs. I had to actually fry these a little longer than I do chicken because these legs are thick. So this is what it looks like so far. I'm just letting the grease drain off of it right quick. And I'm going to sit it in here on this napkin so it really can rain off. But yeah, I had to cook these a little longer than chicken because y'all can see these legs are thick. They're way thicker than chicken. So I'm going to go ahead and um, put these in here. Like this. I'm going to um, let this grease drain off of them. I'm just going to sit them here for a second. And uh, once the grease drain off of these, we're going to put them on this pan here and uh, we're going to add the buffalo sauce to it. So actually, Kamaya is, Kamaya is going to do it. Okay, uh, we're going to put these rabbit legs in here. Now, she's just going to take... She's just going to take the sauce and put it all over the rabbit legs and then we're going to stick them in the oven here. So you can, she can go ahead and do that. So when we get through baking them for a while, we just want to bake them for a while, let the sauce get all over them. Some people uh, 
boil their sauce and do things to it, but I'm not going to do that with this one because it really don't need anything. So once she gets done uh, putting this sauce all over the legs, we're going to just stick it in the oven right quick. And uh, we'll be right back with you all to show y'all how it turned out. So stick with us. This is the finished product, you all. This is the Rabbit Hot Wings. I told you all this technique was really simple and easy. All we did was cleaned off the rabbit legs, seasoned them up, fried them in a the deep fryer, or you can fry them or whatever you want to. We didn't add flour. Now, remember, you can if you want. It's just something that I don't do. We put the sauce on there. We put it in the oven. We let it bake for about 10 minutes. I added me some celery. I have me some ranch here. I hope you all enjoyed the video. Um, I said it was, you know, it's real quick, simple technique. I hope you all try it sometimes. We're going to try it on video in a minute. We're just letting it cool off, and uh, we'll be right back with you all. Let's see if the kids like it. They said they'll taste test it for me. Y'all like it. It tastes better than regular chicken. They said it tastes better than regular hot wings. I can't wait to try it myself. Yeah, yeah. I hope y'all like this recipe and I hope y'all try it. Get y'all some rabbit and try it. We'll see y'all again on the next video. Bye. Bye.